Welcome to a guided meditation for feelings of remorse on Declutter the Mind. At any time during this practice, if it becomes difficult, go back to the breath. Even if you need to pause the practice within the app, feel free to do it. Take a break from the session and bring yourself back to the breath. Don't allow yourself to become lost in thought or allow your mind to get away from the practice. This is where a lot of suffering can begin to manifest. So instead, bring yourself back to the breath and back to the rising and falling sensations of the breath. And so with that, let's just find our seat. Let's sit comfortably with our back upright and close your eyes. And so let's begin to breathe slowly and deeply and place your attention on how you are feeling both emotionally and physically but try not to analyze what you are feeling just be in the experience acknowledge your emotions in a gentle and loving way and understand that we're not trying to resist or change how we feel here we're just becoming curious of this feeling of remorse for a few moments. And so mindfulness means acceptance of the present moment, whether that's our mood or what we feel. It's normal to feel remorse and it's normal to experience it in waves. If it ever becomes unbearable, steady your mind by bringing your attention to the breath, the physical rising sensations in the chest with the inhale the falling sensation with the exhale, not allowing thoughts of helplessness to distract us, just maintaining an open awareness on the breath and noticing the feelings of sadness and remorse come and go as you leave your attention here for the next few moments. And as you sit here watching the breath and each inhale and exhale with an open awareness, it's good to remember that there is no set length of time a person will experience remorse. Time doesn't always heal the pain of remorse, but it does help lessen it. And so patience is an important virtue to remember here. Healing remorse takes time. There's no easy way out of the pain and suffering we endure as a result of it. Yet, 
it's important to feel the emotions as they are moving through us rather than avoiding them or bearing them. Acting as if we are fine when we are not is how we suppress emotional pain that will later show up as any number of problems down the road. And so just continue to place an open awareness over the breath. Noticing all these sensations of breathing, the air going through the nose, the air leaving the mouth on the exhale. Again, noticing the steady and calming sensations of the rising and falling of the breath. And as you watch the breath, it's normal for other images and feelings around remorse and sadness to come and go, such as pain, anger, love, fear, disbelief. Notice these feelings, but don't get caught up in the story of them. Don't get caught up in thinking of them or becoming lost in thought. Just allow them to pass. Allow them to enter your stream of consciousness and pass all on their own. Again, it's important to have some acceptance here. Resistance and trying to add or subtract anything here only creates more suffering. When we can have an open awareness of the present moment without any judgment and with acceptance, we can find tranquility and peace. And if it helps to steady your mind and stop it from wandering, you can count the breaths as they pass. And so the in-breath one, the out-breath two, until we reach a count of 10 and start the count over. And if your mind wanders or you become lost in thought, simply start to count over and count the breaths again.
And notice if you are adding a story to your remorse. It's important here to just notice the remorse, to just notice the feeling of it, the gravity of it, where we physically notice it more, all without adding anything to it, all without adding a judgment, examination, or story about it. The story of the remorse is separate from the feeling itself. See if you can truly see and be mindful of this feeling without the story. And again, at any moment, if this becomes intense or you get caught up in the story, bring your attention back to the breath. And in the final moments of the practice here, simply allow yourself to let go. Let go of this maintaining of attention on the breath. Let go of anything you've been struggling with in this practice. Let go of anything you've been adding or resisting. And just sit here and allow the mind to do what it wants for the next few moments. And now, open your eyes. Thanks for sitting, and I'll see you next time. Thanks again for taking the time to practice. If you've enjoyed this practice, please be sure to like and subscribe. You can also join and become a member and receive access to courses and more. Head on over to declutterthemind.com for more and download our free iOS and Android app.